It's smaller than the size of five tennis courts. That is why it worked. This little arrangement was built for a total strength of 450 men, of whom 311 have just departed. The total strength left here now is 139, of whom 35 were sick, of whom 16 cannot even move. And then there are various non-combatants. There are only 100 fighting men, that's all. And they are very thinly spread between the little cubby holes of the hospital building and the barricaded walls of the commissariat stores and the cattle crawl. And I put it to you that this leaves a very flat little handful of men for the defense of this now rather large perimeter. The movie Zulu manages to capture the spirit of this fight. The part of Bromhead was played by Michael Caine. Bromhead in the movie was not deaf. You may remember this scene. Bromhead says to Chard, What's that noise that we can hear? It sounds like a train. It was not a train. It was the noise that you get when you thump 4,000 assegai shafts against 4,000 shields. Thump, 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 thump. Coming from the other side of the Oscarburg Ridge. Coming from an enemy they couldn't see. And with this sort of pressure being brought to bear on these below average officers, below average my foot, they made another above average decision. They took this handful of Welshmen from the valleys and they raced across the courtyard into that commissariat store and they hauled out those big heavy wooden boxes that contained army biscuits and they ran a wall four foot high of biscuit boxes from the near corner of the storeroom across the courtyard to the edge of the ledge. They cut the courtyard in half with a line of biscuit boxes. It was brilliant. It gave them a second line of defense. It gave them the choice of falling back into the area on the far side of that wall or into the area on the near side. And if it wasn't for that line of biscuit boxes, the Battle of Rourke's Drift would have been a very short one indeed. A Welshman told his mother that the most important part of the whole defensive arrangement was built of biscuit boxes. He added too that army biscuits could stop anything. <laughs>